Hello and welcome back to Let's Interactively Play Morrowind with me, Variax. In this session I will be continuing, well, starting the main quest. Because pretty much half of the comments for the last video was to start the main quest. And it has been a theme throughout the, uh, the suggestions to start the main quest. So it was bound to come up sooner or later. So here we are, starting the main quest. In order to do so we have to go to Balmora. Which I believe... Should I walk or should I... What's the best way to get to Balmora? Because it is... not Aldruin or Balmora is all the way down there. So I'm not going to walk there. So if I get a boat... And I travel to... I think that's... Further south. So if I go, if I go there and then head inland I should be able to get to Balmora. Let's check where we are now. Yeah, that's much better. That's much easier. Right. So if we head inland from here... Let me just uh, get used to the controls again. Yes, there we are. We've got to go and see... Um, I forget his name. Cass Cassius... Corsair... Something like that. Wait a minute, where am I going? I'm supposed to be heading that way, aren't I? Okay, up there. Because... At the very very start of the game, you head into the census office, and uh, the the you've forgotten his name as well. But there's a there's a captain guy, and he says you got to go and see Cassius, so uh, and give him this coded message. Yes, once again with the uh, alchemy stuff going on. Alchemy, 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 alchemy. Yeah, it gives you a coding message, you got to give it to Cassius, so you got to head to Balmora, find Cassius, and that's where it all begins, the massively epic main quest. The main quest which is, in my humble opinion, and uh, many other people's, the quest, the uh, main quest which is far superior than the main quest in Oblivion, because the main quest in Oblivion, sorry, I know there's a lot of Oblivion fans out there, and I am among them, don't get me wrong, but the main quest in Oblivion was find this, find this, find this, close the gate, 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 find this, close the gate, kill him, there you go, we've won. Um, okay, that was not totally accurate, but you usually what I mean, whereas in Morrowind it's much more political, uh, it starts out a lot slower, um, and yeah, it's more meaty, you know, it's it's it it also seems harder because it's it just seems a lot longer. You have to do a lot more things and it um it seems not more world changing, but um you just seem to have more of an impact in things. I don't I don't really know what I, what I'm trying to say, but but you uh you kinda of become more powerful as an individual in Morrowind than you do in Oblivion. From, from a political standpoint. Anyway, we have arrived. We have arrived in Balmora. We're actually going to stay here this time rather than just very briefly seeing it from this Silt Strider. Hey, Silt Strider. Yeah, said a little back. The journal tells us that we have to go to the South Wall Corner Club here, uh, and then he'll, some guy in there, will tell us where Cassius. Oh, Cassade, Cass Cassius Cassades, or, or whatever his name is, is. but I, I, I can't know where he is, and I'm sure all of you people know where he is as well, so I'm just going to head straight to his house. This is Balmora, it tends to be sort of the, the hub, it's many players' base, because for a lot of the quests, like there's a, there's a all of the guilds here, and, and Cassius is here as well, so... Uh, many people tend to have their base in, in Balmora. Um, Chaos Cossain, no, not, not, not Cassius then, it's Chaos. There we go. He has no shirt you on. Want something, friend? Yes. I was kind of curious as to why he had no shirt on and why there's like a, a skooma pipe and stuff, but I think it's because he's like, this, this is his cover, there's like a skooma addict. I don't think I'll be nicking anything from him. Um, but yeah, he's really one of the, the, the Blades, which is in Morrowind. No, talk to him. Which is in Oblivion as well. 
But uh, we'll get to that in a minute because he's going to talk to us about that soon. Report for you, yes. Yeah, look at it. There you go. Right, so yes, do you, do you want to follow my orders? Uh, yes, I do. Otherwise I won't be able to do the main quest. He tells me that I um, I have to go and improve my skills and uh, go and find some work and stuff first. Or do I want my orders straight away? Yeah, so... Go and he it tells me to join a guild, find you know, increase my increase my skills. He gives me two hundred gold pieces, which is gonna be big help. Um So I got I think I've got to have to exit out and then come back and yeah, does he want my orders? Right. I am ready for orders. I have to talk to Hasfat. Uh yeah, Hasfat. Uh, another LP I called Gix. Found that very amusing and it is very amusing. Hasfat. Uh, in in the uh, fighters guild, so I got to find him, ask him about the Nerovine uh, cult and the sixth house secret cult. Uh, that's what I got to do. So I got to go and talk to Hasfat over in the fighters guild. I'll play the I'll play through this for as as long as um. I feel I've played it for like I'll play it for about half an hour and see how far I get in the main quest, which probably won't be very far. The good thing is I do know what I'm doing. Um, I'll say that and then screw up, <laughs> but I have a pretty good idea about what I'm doing, so should be able to breeze through a fair bit of it. Go to the Fighters Guild. How many arrows do I have? Okay, I have enough. I have 50 arrows. Don't talk to any of these people. Head down here. Open this door and talk to him. There he is. Right, so um, you're from Chaos. Okay, yes. Um, yeah, as I said before, I won't be able to pronounce any people's names uh, unless they're spoken in some way. Uh, Alright, so if he wants me to do a f him a favor. He wants me to find a Juma. Uh, puzzle block box from this uh, dwarven ruin called Arkenthang. Danged. There, that place there. So yeah, once I find the the, the puzzle box, he'll uh, uh, and return it to him. He'll tell me what I need to you know. No, I don't want anything. Let's check this room and see if there's like anything to lock level five. I might actually be able to. Unlock that. Oops. Oh no, that's fine. Press the wrong button there, but we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. So I think I have a lock pick. Yeah. So let's have let's have a go at this. Come on. Come on. Yeah, here we go. I don't think I'm gonna bother with this. Nope. I should have picked security. I really should have picked security. I don't think this is going to happen. No. I do have another lock pick, but I'm not going to... Uh, not going to waste my time with that anymore. Let's just head to this, this ruin. Hmm. There's a pretty hard fight on the way to the ruin. On a bridge. Uh, against uh, a conjurer mage type, wiz uh, type warrior. Um, so yeah, it's going to be quite um, an issue getting past that guy. Maybe I should have uh, stocked up on some things, but I'm going to try my luck. I'm going to try my luck against this guy. Should be okay. I do have a bow, and I have a, I have like a demon katana, which makes a bound longsword, which was demonstrated against the uh, vampires in the last video to be quite effective at killing things, so... Hopefully, hopefully we won't, we won't have too much problems. That's weird, I hate it when that happens. I hate that, I hate that. Okay, there we go. It's all good. Times like this, you really wish there was a fast travel system in Morrowind. I don't like the fast travel system especially, but for the purposes of an LP, it'd be quite handy. Because now I have to think of things to say <laughs> on the way <laughs> from, you know, wandering around, taking bits of chokeweed. Alright, and it's this way, it's up here.
and I'm going to start walking pretty soon to restore my fatigue so I, I don't get utterly owned by this guy. My uh, kind of tactic is going to be to um, shoot him with arrows and then finish him off with my demon katana. Seems like a pretty, pretty good plan. I don't really have any other options to be honest. I don't have that much else at my disposal. I need to buy some spells. I need to get some gold to buy some spells. I do have a few um, bit of gold now, so maybe I'll be able to um, buy a few spells when I return.